Hey guys, welcome back, Kaiserreich for People's Public Oblivion, episode 11. Last episode we got screwed, pretty much did all the fighting, and somehow they made a peace deal without us, where we got none of the land. And, yeah, we got screwed. We quite frankly, rightfully got screwed. We got nothing from this war. I think Potosi wasn't even ours. Someone can correct me on that. I'm pretty sure Potosi wasn't ours. So we got screwed there. After building all this infrastructure, doing everything, doing everything in this damn war, and it just retcons itself and fucks up. I'm, I'm in a bad mood now, because I get a land. I got none. I got zilk. I got nothing. I don't want to guarantee anything. They took my land. I would love Brazil if they explained this to me. <laughs> if they gave me some of that fucking land. I helped them. Or maybe I was a bit of them. I gave them all that land. I fought most of their war until they got off their ass. <laughs> this is. This is disgraceful. Disgraceful. Insert me about NRL here. So you're saying I spent this whole damn time waiting on some idiot? It it's truly, truly outrageous. Like honestly, I'm hoping there's an event that pops up, but. I don't even think that is. I think it got screwed up because I waited. I couldn't wait for them to declare war, so I did it myself, and that messed it up. Infra was recognized as. And now they're sending troops to Germany for reasons that are beyond me. I don't get that. It's. Probably one of the hardest things I've ever had to watch. <sighs> yeah, if I if I sound disappointed, because I am, I'm absolutely in shock here. What more can I do? What more can I do? What more can I give? Nothing. I can't give anything. Shout out to Bulgaria, my homies. They stayed strong. They used to be strong, but now they're just a puppet. Shout out to my fans. Everyone's been commenting. I know you are, dude. You comment on like all my videos. I'm so happy with that. It motivates me to keep going, even for all this bullshit. This is. If I'm in Iron Man, I think I am. Tag. Yeah. I don't have any access to man, so I can't even rectify this and properly do it. I wouldn't give myself all the land, that's not the thing. I'll give myself Paul Grey and probably like this. Juju. Is that too much to ask? Like. Even after fighting the war for them. And I feel like this is another case of Brazil just screwing us. Fuck us around. They're sending freaking Japan, Philippines, there's a war there. I guess the thing I can do now is move on, you know. Try to fix that, but this is what this is about. I'm taking every single part of my friggin' land back. I do not care how long it takes. I'm going to get every last bit of it back. Okay? I will take everyone in South America, and I'll take down Brazil myself. That, that's not... 
some empty wood fronts that is a guarantee. I'm sorry if I seem frustrated and... Oh. Surely took states, prove his annex. That ain't good. Because now we have to prepare for all that. They made a Peru Public Republic. <laughs> Peru Peruvian Popular Republic. Well, I'm sorry. No. You bastards have doubted us for too long, okay? Every last time I've done all this shit. Okay? I don't give a damn about anyone anymore. This is all about Bolivia. This is the people's Republic of Bolivia. I'm gonna take down these bastards limb from limb. They are not a true revolution. Where was their help? Either they're with us or they're against us. This ain't no place place for the weak hearted. So we're gonna take them down and we're gonna destroy them. And I still don't have resources. Like, I find that literally mind-boggling. I can't just be like, hey, can I have my land back? No, you can't. Okay, thanks, dickhead. They hold our key provinces. You're damn right they have. And you? Wait. Actually, no. Screw that. Scrap order. I'm one you bastard, okay? You got some stuff. This is a matter of me getting revenge. I don't even care about resources, any of that crap. This is me getting what I need for me. To beat the absolute living crap out of those stupid Portuguese bastards. No offense to real Portuguese, if you're watching. I don't think they are. <laughs> I, I've got a diverse audience. Australia, um, United States. I think I saw some guy from Korea. I don't know. It's, it's great to see all these people watching my videos. Even for it's not much, it's a small audience. But it's nice to be watched. It's good. It motivates me to keep going. You know? I feel like we're the we're the Italy of World War One, you know, we're pissed that we didn't well Italy after World War One. We're pissed we didn't get any land, we lost all that men for it. I'm not even gonna get rid of my service by requirement. No. Never. Until they can bring back the heart of our people. They're gone. They're dead. They aren't coming back. They're gone forever. Because Brazil wanted that. Now, obviously, I'm not even going to deal with Brazil right now. Brazil, more ask my concerns. I'm not even going to call him on this war. This is my and my war only. I'll just say, oh, they're not radical socialists, or they're not Cindy's, you know? They don't care about the workers. Obviously, I'm going to go off Chile. Chile and me have got bad blood. Ecuador, I don't know what's up with them. Venezuela. You can keep your faith in democracy, because democracy ain't gonna save you from me taking every last bit of your land. We haven't even got a coast yet. We got a little lake. Ain't got shit with a coast. This, my friends, is the frustration of a thousand men. Sorry, we're coming down now. I was a bit frustrated first, but yeah, I obviously will get over it. Just all this resources, all these things. Just went into doing, getting all this, and nothing, 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 nothing. nothing. How's the war going? Russia's getting destroyed, probably because they didn't even assign their troops properly. They're gonna lose Petrograd. 
I've showed you this. They're pushing through Austria. So what's happened in Dark Cell? Um, if you want to play Kaiserak and you don't like Hearts of Iron, you don't have to play in this. This Dark Cell. It's not that expensive. I think it's ten bucks on Steam. That's good. That's pretty much mostly. Com that's completed. They're still updating it, but not as much as this. Like there's as big focus, or maybe that's just what I think. So you know, obviously, you can play that. I might do a playthrough of that, but I'm not that good at Dark as hell. Like, I probably do a will of, like, every country in the game. Because, <laughs> like, they all got events and everything. Um, not every country in this has events yet. It's still alpha. Like, so it's still in development. So there's gonna be problems. I guess that gives it a little bit of leeway. Uh, So yeah, that gives it some legal wave, so I don't, I'm not trying to get too mad at that, so. Get all these troops in the Portugal and border. I'm not inviting Brazil in this war. He already screwed me over enough, like. They don't even have a troop, so I can just like. Are you kidding? To August? Okay, so here's the plan. That's literally my plan. Just take their capital. And we don't have to worry about anything. While well, I'm at it, I'm gonna watch the world. Germany's got tanks and they're pushing through the French Republic. Good on them. It's Petit. Petit isn't dead. Petit died a little after World War I. World War II, World War II. Instead of Vichy France. I'm like 46, 48. Correct me if I'm wrong. Actually, I'll, I'll look it up, because let's be honest, we're not going to be doing overly much, you know. Production's going to stay the same. Actually, I might cut down production of this and make it focused on that. And I need to get more steel. Because we've got nearly no steel, and no one can trade with us because we don't have a land route. So all we can trade with is pretty much North America, uh, South America, and North. Until we actually get a port, which uh, I need quite desperately. So. A minister supports his ideology. No, no we can't. We are a dict- I mean, we are trying to persuade him to join our side. Okay. Philip Petit. I'm gonna give you a little history lesson here. So. Might as well give a history lesson while we're here, you know, watching this world and not doing much. He died in 1951. We're a little off by a couple of years. He was formerly a French general who was the Marshal of France. He did the defense of the Doom. And he was a national hero. And he's also known as the. Oh, Poland has capitulated against France. God, they interrupted my story time. Very rude of them. Um, 84 years old in 1940 is the oldest French head of state. So. Yeah, he's outstanding military leadership in World War One during the Battle of the Doom. He was a national hero and was not executed for what he did with VG France, so he wanted um, them to surrender to the front the Germans. So he helped did that. They always say he was a little bit of a coward. So yeah, he changed the country, became more fascist. Yeah, very much more fascist. So, yeah. Petit didn't want to go. Petit wanted to keep the land. And he would have to suck up the Germans to get that. So they signed an armistice. So they got two fifths. So they got around. I, I can't really draw it. I think they got here, 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 here. They scale this big area around here, around that area, and that was Vichy France, I think Italy took one of some of this I think, 
and Germany took pretty much the rest. Just to occupy it. They probably would have gave it back. Yeah. So they got rid of the, uh, Third Republic. Oh, jeez. It was a little illegal. It was authoritarian and fascist. Took His regime soon took on clear authoritarian, in some cases, fascist characteristics. Okay. So, soon replaced by work, family, fatherland. Okay. Sounds like a f dictator. Um. Yeah. Not a good idea if I say so. But yeah, he died pretty much. He died, got caught by the French after the war, they called him a villain. Everyone was like, no, don't kill him, they're like, oh, okay. So they just kept him up in this tower and that was that. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm just reading off his wiki page. You can tell him a great historian, my friend. Uh, oh, that's a little, I'm getting a little bit of lag now. You always get a little bit of lag late game because you have the war. And you got all these wars going on, and you gotta kind of fend against that. Look how slow we are. I'm gonna have to drop down these graphics. We ain't got time for high quality graph action. Oh yeah, we're not we're not doing that. We're not doing that. <laughs> we are not playing with great graphics, kiddos. This is what you're getting. I should keep the rivers. Keep the rivers. I need rivers, weather doesn't really matter, I guess cities. Yeah. So yeah, the world burns as we currently sit. After getting, oh, the, wait, 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 what? So Hawaii's, I guess in the coast prosperity sphere, whatever the hell it's called. Not really, but that's what they call it. And you're saying... I gotta find a way. Me too. Yeah, sorry, my geography ain't good. So, how are they still join the international? The Hawaiian Revelation. Holy shit. Uh, <laughs> that's so shit. Actually got decent tree. So now they're gonna join the international. How are they gonna do that when Okay, one the following must be true. Oh, okay. I find that stupid, but uh I'll let that roll, I guess. The amount of sense it makes to me is zero. I kinda wanna start making refineries, uh synthetic, because I don't have any oil and after getting screwed, and you know, can't make any oil what we have. I, I'm I'm really angry about that. You guys know how it feels. Like, yeah. I just want this war to go ahead. Can we just kill them? Beat them up? I want to do all this. God. This is a boring part, waiting for justification of war. Like... Chili's ready. Chili I'm not scared of. Actually, I'm honestly not scared of anyone. They don't have any troops. Uh, these guys... Yeah, even Venezuela, I don't know why I'm scared of them. We could easily beat them up. Yeah, what I'm gonna do, take that capital, get all that land, focus on the Chile war. Oh, what happened? And Austria was just annexed. Oh god, that's ugly. I hate these trees, man. They're so bad. So when is this war gonna end? They can't end it until they take over Germany again in its stupid bloody place here. That's all kind of makes me frustrated about it. Because it takes so long to take over it, it doesn't do anything. And. Eh. Go away. 
the yeah Iberian Federation call it that it's truly a I wish I got those kind of I don't get any I don't get that good of a street. it's good but like but Spain is a pretty good country in this. I'll let me auto save. I'll let them auto save. Oh, Jesus Christ! That's a lot of troops. Wow. Wow. That's crazy. <laughs> oh my god, this border gore. I hate it. Oh, concentrate industry done. Uh, uh, um. Motorizes, that's all done. Uh, I got that. I'll start moving toward motorized. I just need rubber and uh, uh, oil. And oil can be get, be gotten. So, but rubber is big of a problem. I think Peru has it. That's why we need to take them. I see Portugal has capitulated and fall this Lisbon. Yep, Spain is it. Iberia. We we saw that first. Yeah, the inside of knowledge. CSA is just kind of sitting there, not doing anything. They're just kind of like. I don't, have, I don't think they even have an option to join the war. No. Ah, uh, slaughter card. No, they go on. Pax Americana. Pax America. So you gotta get all this. The Reed Doctrine. Reclaiming America, Californian Strike, the Yank Strike. Um all treaties right now. Eh. Oh god. Still so ugly. I don't even know what France is doing. They don't, haven't even made like custom countries for that, so. Mm. What can you do? That's with less time focusing on war. Increase all this. I'll get, I'll get 200. And research, I'll focus on the Marines. That's what we want, the Marines, because the Marines are really nice and stuff. Let me keep looking at war and how we've got fucked. Man. I feel like Kaiser X is kind of a worse world to be in. There's just so many wars going on. Yeah. Yeah, actually, I think this is a worse thing. So, is Hawaii, like, still with them? Let me check it over all three islands. Oh god, this lag. So they're already out of there. They took their leave and they're pissed off. Good on them. Hope Japan doesn't go. Oh, I don't like that. So. What I'll probably do, because the episode probably will end soon, 
I'm probably just gonna sim this until I get to when the justification is done, and then I will I will make I will make another video from that point on. So you you might miss a little, but honestly, you probably won't miss anything. It makes it easier for everyone. I get to not lag as much with both of these things running, and then. I get to not have to film that, and you guys don't have to be bored watching it, and me trying to entertain you. But hey, if you're entertained, then I'm happy with that. Fucking hell, that's a lot of shrimps. Yeah, oh my god, Rush just get screwed. All the time. Again and again. It's just... Mm. My hands are cold. It is a cold day here, obviously. Squeaky chair. Yeah. Um, you guys, uh, one of you asked why there's a motorcycle in the background. I have no clue, to be honest. I couldn't tell you if I was a left hander or. I mean, I couldn't tell you. I think it's just OBS. I, I'll try to fix it. I might have to, like, boost my mic, you know, try to do something like that. I'll see how that works. I'll see how that works. I'm done making trips for now. I think 14 is good enough. We'll be fine. So my plan, push through these guys, take Peru. If I can just declare war on them and then go through there, that would be fun. A spectre is haunting America. Yeah, you're damn right it is. Three Columbian things, yeah. You can do that. Or you can do this. Free Peru. We can free Peru together. But I'm getting my land. So you can piss off. Do I need them? I don't I probably would maybe, but even then I think I could beat them. Alright. Oh my god, no one's giving me steel, man. Where's the bloody iron? Don't want to try to prove Too much to trade of goods, okay. Steel, but no one's gonna trade it to me. There. Thank you. Sorry, I'm gonna keep going. Actually, I think I'm gonna end off the episode here. I'll be back when this justification's all done. Okay.